Hi, my name is Josiah Middaw, and I live right down the road in Eagle Vale, Colorado. And I've had a long career in Xterra, and I was the 2015 Xterra World Champion. I've been a long time resident in the Vale Valley. I've been here about 18 years now. Um, and it's just the perfect training environment for me. It's right around 8,000 feet elevation. So it's uh, right at what's considered scientifically at moderate altitude. So it's the best for you know, boosting some of the blood values that you're looking for and also um, not too high so you can still get some good performance with your workouts. I'm here at the GoPro Mountain Games. I think this is probably my 15th year uh, racing here. Uh, this weekend I'll be doing three events. I'll be doing the cross country mountain bike race and then Sunday the Vail Pass time trial. It's a hill climb and then I'll also do Peppy's face off which is a, a vertical challenge going up and down a uh, ski run as many times as you can in 30 minutes. In triathlon you're trying to be jack of all trades but you're often master of none and so to be able to compete you know just against cyclists just against runners um, it's a, an opportunity to just really uh, you know take some chances with your effort um, and test yourself against some of the best people and a lot of these events are they're raced a little bit differently in a in a triathlon it's more of a time trial from start to finish and more of a race against the clock. With these races, they're a lot more tactics, um, really deeply anaerobic at times, especially with the mountain bike and the trail run. So it's a, a good opportunity to really get out of your comfort zone. An action camera uh, actually has a, a few benefits for me as a professional athlete and would have some benefits for some amateur racers as well. As a professional athlete would be to, to gather some media uh, for some of your sponsors and get some really cool footage. As an athlete, for a technical race like an Xterra, it's a really good way to get some footage of the course so you can actually do a course recon with the GoPro. You can come back to it the next year. A lot of these courses are the same and you can kind of use that for mental imagery or whatever you want or just to show off how sick your mountain bike skills are. <laughs>